Atlas. Wow. Incredible. Wow. That is absolutely beautiful. Yes. Clearly, the Eversource is capable of miraculous things. And when I get my hands on it... Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes! I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, it would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it, he won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. I'm starting to think that maybe we should try and keep a low profile while we look for the inn. These people seem pretty suspicious of us. Agreed. Hello! It is nice to meet you! Boy, these are some popular crafting tables. Don't worry, everyone. Your turn will come in time. Please have your materials ready when you approach the crafting table. Huh? I knew I shouldn't have waited so long to eat. This is a long line just to use a crafting table. You're telling me. I'm so hungry I could practically eat my wheat right here. But I won't. I'll be patient and turn it into delicious bread instead. What, uh, what can I do for you? I'm so hungry. I heard you guys have an inn somewhere around here. Where is it? Oh, uh, Milo's place? <laughs> that guy's hilarious. He's over that way. Milo, huh? Thanks. No problem. Hey there. Are you on the schedule for the furnace this afternoon? Didn't think there were any more appointments today. Hang on. Let me see here. Dale, ten stone blocks. Oh yes, that went very well. Melissa, three cooked pork chops. She rescheduled. Classic Mel. Uh, no appointment for me. Thanks. I'm actually looking for the inn. Milo's place, right? It's back there. Right. Milo. Thanks. No building, no crafting, no brewing, no forging, unless with express permission from the founder. All complaints must be registered in person. That's it, you can stop writing now. Intense. Hey, Petra. What you looking at? Just admiring the sights, actually. This place is so cool. I'm not usually one for, like checking out people's builds or whatever, but even I have to admit, this is really impressive. Captain Reginald, at your service. Hey, so what are you guys up to? Ah, just supervising this citizen while she does her build. The Founder finally approved my petition. The Founder? Well, that's her palace up there. She is the keeper of the Eversource. Builds everything you see. Some days I can't even fathom how she keeps it all straight. She's incredible. I'm a... I'm a fan. She builds everything? Yeah, well, it sure is amazing. <laughs> That's why she gets to make the calls about what does or doesn't get built. Like my build. It's no easy feat to get all these oak blocks. Your petition was very well handled. Oh, gosh. That's nice of you. Uh, if you're just admiring the build, could you please step back a bit? We need to get back to it. Thanks very much. Hi. Uh, hello. You know where the inn is? Uh, yeah, I guess so. I don't trust the innkeeper, though. If you really want to find him, his inn's over there. Thanks. I'll leave you to it, then. Does 
How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah. I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. I believe they just built their way right into town. I know, I've never seen anything uh, like it. Hello. Oh, oh my. Hello again. Can we uh do anything for you? Can you two point me in the direction of the inn? They must be looking for Milo. Shh. Uh, I mean, no, no, no. We don't know any Milo. Really? Because it sure sounds like you know him. Uh, okay, okay. We know of him. If you really want to find him... He's the kind of messy-looking guy. Spender's always falling down. So messy. Thanks, I guess. I'll just leave you guys alone, then. Have a nice day. Please stop building. It scares me. What? Nothing. Ooh, we could have almost died just oh, then. Hush. Don't step on the grass, please. Okay. Sorry. I just take my job very seriously, because it is, in fact, serious business. Not many people get the honor of watching the tree, but <laughs> I'm pretty good at my job. What do you think about working for the founder? Oh, she's the absolute best. Very honored to be a part of helping keep the order. Very honored and proud. Sorry I'd explain more, but I actually have to get back to my work. Sorry. Uh, please continue to not step on the grass. Thank you. And where should I put them? Yes, just get them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go! Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here, it is considered impolite to stare. I heard from someone in town that you could help me. Other people were talking about me? <laughs> they must have me mistaken with some other handsome innkeeper. <laughs> Out of curiosity, what is it that uh, they thought I could help you with? I'm sorry, but I'm actually quite busy. Inns don't keep themselves, you know. Lots of busy work. Some punks are trying to steal the Eversource. Know anything about it? Really? You come up to me interrogating me about some outlandish nonsense, and then you want to discuss someone stealing our city's most valuable treasure? I don't want any part of it. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, this our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet? Is he hiding them somewhere? I am uncomfortable with this line of questioning. Come on. You can trust me. Nothing bad is going to happen. Just help us. Fine. If it will make you leave me alone, that Aiden fellow did come talk to me earlier. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps. Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. So, where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. 
Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. I wonder what that's all about. Oh, it's the founder. I wonder what this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Oh, this is not good. What are you... Oh, crap. People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. Crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. Whether these outsiders know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are you the bridge builders? Obscene! The builders! Atrocious! Everyone! Everyone! Please! I didn't know it was against the law. It was just a bridge. This is nuts! Jesse, wherever you are, step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws, but I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to that other source at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. By getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I built the bridge! Are you crazy? Does she look like she's gonna help us? Hey! Unhand me! Come on. Sorry, Ivor. I'm going. Me too. Quick then, follow me! Wait, wait! Hey, I'm coming hey. peacefully! That's them! They're getting away! After them! Jesse, run! Run! Can't over there! Come on! Where are you going? Just in here, yes. There's nowhere to hide in here. It's a dead end. Before I take you to any further, you must take an oath. I think they went this way. You must swear to never reveal what I'm about to show you. What? Do you swear that? Can't let him get away. Milo, I solemnly swear that I will never tell your secret to anyone else. Fantastic. Philippe? Right this way! This is Build Club. Whoa. Everything you see before you was built from resources that my people have saved or uh, obtained. Man, can't be easy to come by some of this stuff. Nice work. It can be difficult, it's true. Many items have to be snuck under the noses of guards. Wow, this is quite the secret hideout, Milo. Very nice. <clears throat> it is not a hideout. It is a build club. You see, one day, a long time ago, I was just a citizen of Sky City, like any other, 
I wanted to make a community garden, so I put in a petition for a dirt block, and mercy me, it was granted. But in my excitement and haste to build my garden, I accidentally dropped my new block, and it fell right over the edge. For my crime, I was tossed into the Founder's dungeons. And I was in there for a very, very long time. Well, okay, but it was an accident. They can't lock you up for that, can they? Oh, but they can. It was deemed an egregious wasting of resources. You see, in our world, when something falls over the edge, it is gone forever. But I have always believed in my heart that just because building is risky, it doesn't mean that no one should do it. If only I had known you were builders sooner, I would have helped you all escape when I first met you, rather than let your friends be taken. But at least you are here, yes? I would like to save Lucas. You said something before about having a plan. A different way into the palace to save our friends. Yes, I did say that. Hey, Milo! Ah, hello, my friends. Bringing in outsiders? Seriously? Pretty hard to keep this a secret club if you just bring people in. Yeah, we have it hard enough as it is. Everyone, please! Hey, guys, don't worry. We're builders, just like you. Yeah, Jesse's right. Just chill out. We're the ones that built that bridge into town today. What? Dude! Milo, jeez! Milo, are you kidding me? The most wanted criminals in the whole city? We gotta turn them in before the guards break our door down. Well, no, let's not do that. I assure you, harboring them is worth the risk. They are the epitome of Build Club material. Builders, I'm not sure. They say they're builders. Oh, perhaps a challenge? All right, then. If Milo says you're these amazing builders, prove it. Yeah, build something. Now, see here, this is all highly disrespectful to my guests. I'm the leader here. I think I know my way around a crafting table better than any of you chumps. Oh, cocky. Let's see if you can back that up. We don't know many recipes, so if you just show us something that they build where you come from, you're gonna be just fine, Jesse. Jesse, it took us many weeks to scrape together this inventory. Please, use them for your build. Okay. Thanks. Let's see here. Anyone got something to take notes with? No. Darn, I guess I'll just have to try to remember all this then. Meh, <laughs> getting nervous yet, Milo? <laughs> what? No, of course not. All well, this day is going exactly as I hoped it would go when I... <gasps> we crushed it! Uh, uh... Jesse, what is that thing? Is it... is... is it safe? Fear not, everyone! The golem is under my control and obeys my every whim. I am so sorry we ever doubted you. Your building is truly magnificent. We all bow to you. I can understand why the guards are after you. I mean, that was awesome. Right? I told you. Yeah, we're really sorry. Wowzers. So sorry. <sighs> yeah, sorry. we're sorry. Hey, these things happen. Apologies totally accepted, dudes. Now, uh, how about that whole getting us into the palace thing? Yeah, that would be great. Ah, yes, of course, of course. That is, after all, why you are here. I must say, though, after seeing you in action, your skills are even more impressive than I could have imagined. So impressive that I wonder if I could implore you for a tiny favor. What kind of favor? I help you get into the palace you help me steal the Eversource for my people. Unlimited resources for everyone! I'm overwhelmed at the thought. Are you kidding? We had a deal, Milo. You can't keep changing it around. Yeah, you said you'd help us. And I am helping you. You just need to know, this is the deal. Fine. Now, as for how to get into the palace, According to my informants, the Founder keeps the Eversource behind a secret door located in her throne room. Dramatic. 
Every night, the founder leaves guards at every door. But there's a single window at the back of the palace that is left unguarded. It's an almost perfect point of entry. But it is far too high. <laughs> if we can find a way through that window, the Eversource would be practically within our grasp. Okay, so we'll just climb up. That doesn't seem too hard. You have not seen this wall. We have tried, but it is sheer steel blocks. No handholds. It means you guys need to start thinking like builders out there. We're gonna make a ladder. Building ladders? Craft a way in? If you could show us how to craft something that would reach the window, we could get this heist underway. Jesse, we will never forget this day. Okay, my friends. This should take us right into the throne room. Once inside, we will just need to find the secret entrance that the founder supposedly uses. Isn't it exciting? On our way to changing everything! Freeing the Eversource for the people! Milo, pipe down! There are guards down there! Right, right, right. My apologies. I'm just so excited. Actually, out in the field, applying ladders to a wall! I know. I know. Why are you saying things to me that I already... Whoa! Whoa! Jesse! Jesse! Petra! Boy, am I glad to see you guys. Right back at ya. Lucas! Ivor! We're here to rescue you. I think you're a little late for that. <laughs> yeah. We broke out ourselves. It's a good thing you guys are here. Aiden's going after the Eversource. Which we obviously can't abide! We're here to get it first! Fantastic! That is what we are doing as well! Who, uh, who's this guy, by the way? I mean, I assume he's cool, right? Why would you assume that? Lucas, Ivor, this is Milo. He's the leader of an underground rebellion. Wow. That's pretty cool. A pleasure. Yeah. Hi. Sure. The Founder's secret entrance is... Supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. If it's in here, we'll find it. I'm getting a very door vibe from this. Yeah, what happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's got to be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap! <laughs> Habits of the Enderman by Soren. Wow, how'd that get here?
So, how was prison life? Oh, it was wonderful. I've always wanted time behind bars to work on my poetry. That was sarcasm, in case you were curious. Lava and water, placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone! Genius! That is ingenious! I'm very grateful to you for all of your help. Give yourself some credit, Milo. You've done Build Club proud. Poor dead bush. Barely more than a bundle of sticks. Hopefully no one will miss one dead bush. Perfect. I think that should be everything I need to make a lever now. Okay, let's do this. Ah, my old friend, the lever. Didn't know you were watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities. Huh. I get the feeling this is a special tree. Yes, the ground you're standing on is actually the original island that all of Sky City started from. That tree dropped the saplings that grew into every tree on the island. I may not agree with the Founder's methods, but even I must admit, that's an impressive feat. Wow, that is pretty special. How's it looking? Still looking like it needs power. Don't worry. I'll find the answer. Okay. I believe in you. Zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious, but what does it mean? Hmm. Eggs? The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot?
A sheep? Is... is that a monster? That's not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color-coded what's in them. So, she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. This must be where the resources come from. Different monsters and creatures, different drops. Stay on your toes! We're close! Ah! I can't wait! <sighs> Let's take a look around. Eversource is a chicken? What? Yes. The spawn eggs. It's so simple! Wait. Wait, wait, wait. That's the Eversource? So, the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. Well, throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people! With it, we'll finally be free of the Founder! But that clucking thing is what we came for! Milo's right. The Eversource belongs to the people. What? I thought that was the whole point of this adventure! I knew you were here to steal from me. Ah! Uh, pain! Oh, she's too fast! Just give me a second to catch my breath. Hey! Don't you dare hurt them! <laughs> Says the trespassing criminal. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic Order of the Stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe them! Ugh, Aiden, would you just shut up already? You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves, and here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous! Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. Thanks to you, we get to see what really happens 
when you fall off the islands. Hey, you can't pin this on me! This is your fault! Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious! Trusting the blaze rods, hiding the Eversource... I didn't do any of that! Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless for my sake or excruciating for yours. Impossible. That's impossible. Jesse? There! Can we get to it in time? It's gonna be close. You're down here, too? Lucas! You made it! Oh, yeah. Only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Mm. Got me pretty good. I'm just so glad you're okay. When Aiden pitched you over the side, that was awful. Yeah, I wasn't a huge fan either. <laughs> ah. It was good of you to try and save the Founder. Uh, speaking of whom, is she okay? She's just sort of staring. Let me ask. Founder! Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock or something. Wow. So, guess you were wrong, huh? About there being no ground? I had no idea. How... How could I have known? <sighs> mm. This has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. It was too dangerous. A, a lost cause. Well, land is gonna be a pretty big game changer for you guys. I mean, it's going to change everything. Yes. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little overwhelming. What, what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few deep breaths? <laughs> you can bring all of your people down here. They won't have to... to petition for resources, or any of that stuff anymore. I... I suppose you're right. Yes. We have to go back up and tell them. Getting back up. My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. not a good sign. Aiden's made some big mistakes. He's probably in completely over his head by now. I can't believe Aiden could be so stupid. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my people. Of course, I'll help you. You're the founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please, call me Issa. Okay, getting back up. Getting back up. Let me see what we've got to work with. Hmm. That'll work. What is it? Ah, oh, I see where you're getting at. Nice. Get ready to build the tallest thing you've ever built. What? We're going to build a tower of dirt. All the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Okay, that should do it. Jesse, what is that?
It's the other half of the portal that brought me here. Man, what a relief. I mean, once you get that flint and steel back, it should be a straight shot home now. Well, guys, ready? Yes, I, I think so. I, uh, I think I actually gotta sit this one out, Jesse. Aiden got me pretty good. I'm just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. I'm really sorry. I probably wouldn't be able to keep up anyway. Sit back, Lucas. Jesse's on the case. <laughs> I knew you could handle it. There you go, buddy. Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. Hey, what's with the last goodbye tone? I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, give Aiden another punch for me. Will do. Come on, we've got an epic climb ahead of us. We've got a city to save. Ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. Oh, and Jesse. I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. under attack by monsters now. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Aiden. Come on. We need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo. on your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Quick version, you know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? Well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side.
has taken over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! We need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. Got any potions of invisibility? Here! Can't stop what you can't see. if you don't shut up! Now you listen here! This is between you and me, Aiden. Leave Reginald out of it. I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! Is the Founder with you? I heard... <laughs> what the... Reggie! Not one more step! I killed you once! I could do it again! You thought you could just kick me off the edge? Unfortunately for you, Aiden, I'm pretty tough to kill. Just... die already! Should've left while you had the chance! Someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, this isn't about who wins and who loses. It's about what's right. And that is why you're gonna lose! Someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, this isn't about who wins and who loses. It's about what's right. And that is why you're gonna lose!
wait, wait, wait! Hang on! Hang on! I... I... I surrender! I surrender! We can talk about this, right? Here! Here! You want your flint and steel back, huh? Take it! It's yours! Just... please... don't hurt me! You did it! Jesse! We need to get out of here! What do you want to do with him? Please! This place is getting worse by the minute! You can't just leave me here! Take me with you! After everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. Get moving. You're coming with us. Th th thank you. Thank you, Jesse. Huh. <laughs> More than you deserve, frankly. Thank you enough. You saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. Well, 
Let me tell you, Reggie. The first thing you need to do is go get yourself some wood. How, uh, how do I do that? You find a tree, and then you just start punching. Oh. Freeze, criminals! You're not going anywhere! I knew you'd stop him. Nice work. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. Yeah, I feel a little bad. They just got in over their heads. Way over. Aiden. Oh, uh, hi, Jesse. I'm, uh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to cause all that trouble. I can see where it all went wrong. I've, uh, got some regrets, to say the least. Yeah, I'm sorry too, Aiden. It didn't have to be that way. I was just so jealous, bitter. And you had all this cool stuff going on, and then... I just wanted a piece. I wanted my time to shine, too. I'd say you have a lot to think about. Yeah, yeah. That's for sure. I don't ever want to see you again. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I think I'm just going to stay here. I'll make a little house, find something constructive to do with all my pent-up anger. You know, like being a writer. I won't try to compete with you anymore. Attention! Huh? Attention! Hello, hello everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free! Build whatever we please! Wow! Those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Bah! I'm sure I do look like a naive idealist through the eyes of an oppressive dictator. Hey, both of you! Fighting isn't going to solve anything. It will if I win! Oh, of course you'd think that way. No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Uh well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan. But you can't schedule and organize everything, either. People need to be free to try new things. But you gotta be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. The day that Sky City was liberated. Try and play nice with Milo, okay? I know he's a little crazy and you don't always get along, but he really does care about the people. Yes, I'm starting to see that, and I will do my best. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but... She's all right. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. It's been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh. Just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Oh, that's right. In the middle of all the fighting and everything, I almost forgot. When I was on the ground with the founder before, I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Cuz... I could have sworn I said something. No! You didn't! Huh. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on! Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. It looks like she's having fun running around. 
Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we gonna do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. Now that you don't have to run everything yourself, maybe you could use the time to travel. There's a lot to see. Yes, that's a rather nice notion. How would you like to go explore some of those, um, very tall vertical rocks? We call them mountains, usually. Lovely. After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend, Benedict. Ah, oh, that's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. <sighs> Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Oh, I just saw those pigs and, you know. Oh, yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. See? Just like I told you. One portal back home. Ugh. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No! A little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. Wait till Axel and Olivia hear where we've been. They'll never believe... It... That's... Not what I was expecting.